Hello friends, this is a guided conscious touch, crown chakra, and third eye awakening facial massage. Start with your hands like so, and begin to feel the Reiki energy between your hands. If it helps, you can pulsate the air. Take some deep breaths and get your energy moving. Begin to move your hands towards your face, hovering around your face and crown chakra, located at the top of your head. Begin pressing your hands against your face still focusing the Reiki energy out of your hands. If it helps, envision light pouring out of your hands. You wanna take a couple deep breaths here. Really focus on that energy just pouring out of your hands. Now to the conscious touch. Conscious touch is where you feel the consciousness on both ends. For example, in this case, you will be feeling the touch from your finger's perspective and your face's perspective. The energy of conscious touch moves very slow. When doing conscious touch, I like to say, move at the speed of your skin. Also, use your skin as a map. Only follow it in the way it wants to stretch. Begin by placing both fingers on your third eye. Move your fingers very slowly up and then above your eyebrows. I did not slow down or speed up this video so you can follow the speed exactly how I'm doing it in this video. Remember to focus on feeling the energy of both sides, your face and your finger's perspective. Now you want to move your fingers down to your temples and hold it there, focusing on the conscious touch energy. Really focus on feeling both sides as you move your fingers along your face. You should feel short spurts of peace and what almost feels like electricity coming out of your hands. Focus this conscious touch energy all over your face. Just follow my lead and pace, taking deep breaths often. So remember when I said to move the direction your face wants to move? As you can see here, I stop right about before it hits my chin. And then I begin in the center of my chin and move back towards the spot that I stopped at. 
Is this because my face guided me that it did not want to pull that direction anymore? The reason of that is, is your face really just doesn't want to stretch in that direction. You want to move in a direction that creates smile lines instead of frowny lines. Make sense? Alright, now moving to your sinus area. Sorry, I know it looks like I'm flipping you off here, but I'm not. My middle finger is just stronger than my pointer after doing all that work. Start massaging the sinus area, again, focusing on feeling it from both perspectives. Follow my lead here. If you do massages like this often, it will also help with aging signs and wrinkles. My face is naturally kind of oily, so if yours is dry, use coconut oil. When massaging your face, you want to massage upwards. Here I'm just doing a zigzag massage across my forehead, just massaging out any frown lines I might have on my forehead, and still focusing on the conscious touch energy. I'm also doing an upward motion here, as well just to massage out any frown lines. This type of technique really helps relax your face. Sometimes you wouldn't believe how much stress we hold in just our face. Now you want to take two fingers and begin massaging your temples in a slow circular motion, a very slow circular motion. Again, you want to focus on the conscious touch energy. above your cheekbone that feels super good to put some heavier pressure on. As you can see, I kind of fell into a little trance. This area is always generally pretty sore for me, so moving my jaw while I do it helps me to reach places with my finger that I wouldn't be able to reach unless my mouth was open. Now we are moving back to our original Reiki position to bring relaxation and peace back to your face. You'll realize how good this feels after such an intense facial massage. Focusing on the Reiki energy pouring out of your hands, keep opening your mouth and closing it as this will help release stagnant energy in your jaw area. You're now going to bring your hands forward and then into prayer and shake them off as if to remove stagnant energy. Now use your pointer finger on your third eye, focusing again on feeling it from both perspectives. Imagine your third eye opening very slowly, patiently, and in a calm manner. Envision, almost imagine that you're able to push your finger right into your third eye. I've had moments where it feels like my finger goes all the way through. It's super crazy and really shows you just how real our energy centers are. When you begin to pull your finger away, pull it away very slowly as this creates a longing feeling. Lastly but not leastly, just massage your entire face. Just pull the skin around, not too hard, but just to kind of loosen up the fascia around your face. I like to really focus on my jaw area and where I smile because, you know, I use that muscle a lot and hopefully you do too. Really get into your cheek muscles, your chin muscles. And again, I'm kind of obsessed with the sinus area because it feels so good to massage. So just really massage the absolute everything out of that area. Are you seeing me roll my eyes back? It literally feels that good. Now 
one more time right above your eyebrows using your thumbs because I'm sure all your other fingers are kind of tired at this point. Yeah, it feels good. And lastly, thank you for watching. I love you guys. Namaste.